number 17A, a straight line EF inclined 30 degree to HP, while the top view, top view is inclined at 45 degree to XY line, and E is 20mm in front of VP and is below HP, and F is 70mm behind VP and it is above HP. Draw the projections of the line. Obtain horizontal trace while vertical trace is 40 mm below xy line. So, this is the question. Here you go. So, this is the data for drawing the top is given. That is, nd is 20 mm. Actually, this is 20 mm. That is not marked there. ND can be marked and top E makes an angle 45 degree and end F is 70 mm behind VP. So through E we will draw a line this one which is at an angle 45 degree with the XY line and end F is 70 mm 70 mm behind. That means F, F has to be drawn 70 mm above XY dial. EF is the top view. Now, what about NDE for drawing the front view? NDE is below HP is given that. How much below? It is not given. And the other thing is the angle theta the line makes with HP is 30 degree. So, in this case, top view EF has to be rotated and then it is projected upward and from E we will be drawing an, a line at an angle 30 degree so that this point will be a phone dash always this is the case whenever the top is rotated and made parallel to XY line and then if you draw and project upward and then at an angle theta if you draw a line from the front view end you will get the true length so here this point also can be termed as e0 dash it is not written there e0 dash f1 dash this point is f1 dash if this is e0 dash this is f1 dash e0 dash f1 dash is, is equal to true length when this angle theta is given. If this is F1 dash, F0 dash will be this one. E0 dash, F0 dash will be the front view length and its orientation with the XY line. Final front view will be having the same orientation, same angle with the XY line. As this E0 dash, F0 dash is having. Now, Vertical trace is 40 mm below is given. So, since this point, that means EF cuts the XY line at this point B. So, vertical trace will be 40 mm below. So, this is the vertical trace. And we know that this E0 dash, this point is E0 dash. E0 dash, F0 dash shall pass through vertical trace. So, we can shift that line in such a way that it passes through the vertical trace. So this is the final E dash and this is F dash. E dash F dash is parallel to E0 dash F0 dash. E0 dash is not written there. Okay, this is the solution of this problem.